continuing with another micro chapter from The War of Art by Stephen Pressfield. This one's called The Professional Seeks Order. I love this idea and I live it daily. Tidying up is just not something your mother told you, right? It's a powerful habit that can keep your creativity soaring. In fact, I've had other artists even make fun of my organization, right? My materials go in the same place when I'm done and while I'm working. Super important for me. After I'm done painting, I clean my palette and my brushes, and then I put them in the same place every time so I can get to them. I like my paper towels folded a certain way and stacked a certain place so when I need them, I don't need to even think about it. I just grab, wipe my brush, and do what I never need to do. Have you, I mean, as a creator, if you're an artist, if you paint or whatever, have you ever been in the middle of a drawing or a painting and you can't find your pencil or your eraser? Ugh! I hate that. I really dislike that. I mean, there's no quicker way to pull me out of my flow than to have to look for my materials or try and figure out how to dig them out of some pile somewhere. Here's what Stephen Pressfield says about it. Quote, the professional cannot live like that. He is on a mission. He will not tolerate disorder. disorder. He eliminates chaos from his world in order to banish it from his mind. He wants the carpet vacuum, the threshold swept, so the muse may enter and not soil her gown. End quote. I love that. And actually, what he was talking about before that quote was how he had to, he was living in a van, which is totally cool, but he had to dig his typewriter out from under a bunch of clothes and all kinds of trash just to get to work. Ugh. This isn't, of course, this isn't about being obsessive compulsive, right? That's going over the deep end. It's about removing everything that may interfere with your creative flow. That includes distractions and Having a not so clean workspace is a distraction. I mean, we're, we're all busy. And the last thing we want taking up too much time is to search for the right materials just so you can get to be creative, even when you have a really awesome idea. If there is anything that will kill your motivation or sudden strike of insight is to having it clean and organized just to get started. My gosh, that would suck. This is why it's so important to have all your materials organized and ready to begin a project at a moment's notice, ready at hand, right? So how are you going to act on your powerful inspiration to paint if your paints are hidden, uh, hidden away in a closet and you're not sure where your brushes are? Actually, think about it right now. Where are your materials to actually get to work? How can you move them somewhere in your home or wherever you live so you can get to them at a moment's notice. How can you get organized and prepare for your muse? You never know when inspiration will be will strike. So be ready for it.